Up first. Hello, Glamblo. Uh, <laughs> sorry. Hey Makeup Beauty Junkies, I'm Em, and in this bag right here, I have some amazing new products that have just launched. This is my first impression of them all. Let's get started. Ooh. Up first, Hello Glam Glow. Check out this packaging. Here we have the Instamud 60 Second Pore Refining Treatment. They always put Hello Sexy in their packaging. That's nice. So pore refining. This one, I need to smooth a generous layer onto dry, clean skin. I don't rub it in and I wait 60 seconds and I think it's gonna bubble up. So let's have a play here and see what happens. Oi, look out. Okay, it's purple. I'll smooth it in. And now we wait. Look at the bubbles. Ooh, it's really working. Looks like it'll get right in there. What else have we got in here? Witch hazel, aloe vera, clay, licorice root. Pretty good. And I think you'd get a great mask selfie with that. Good color. All right, up next, there's a lot of Too Faced in here. The new peaches and cream. Oh Lord, there's a lot. It's exciting. Also, how cute is the packaging? Let's start with maybe some of these blushes. So it kind of goes on creamy, but then it finishes like a powder. And this one's really beautiful actually. This is called So Peachy. And I like it because it's got a little bit of gold through it as well. Let's have a look at Peach Berry. Oh yeah, that's a really nice color. Fun. So you can probably build them up quite well too. And they're blending out really nicely. I think you'd probably apply this Maybe best with fingers. You could probably try it with a brush as well, but they seem to really warm up and work well with the fingers. And now we have the melting powder highlighter. So this one is called Happy Face. I'm liking the look of this color. Again, same consistency as the blushes. Yeah, nice. Fairly subtle, but I think you could really build that up. Maybe even applying that over like a cream highlight would really intensify it. But yeah, really nice. Really nice consistency, really smooth. There's nothing worse than a highlighter that feels a little bit gritty. Um, you want something that's gonna really melt into the skin and feel like heaven. Up next is the Peach Blur Translucent Smoothing Finishing Powder, infused with peach and sweet fig cream. Sounds like a dessert, but also looks like a dessert. Look at that, yum, delicious. I'm gonna try a little bit of this over my makeup at the moment. By the looks of it, it's a fairly subtle kind of powder. It's got a little bit of that sort of peachy tint to it, so pretty good for color correcting, I would say. Try a little bit through here. Smells amazing. It's sort of giving a little bit of a blurred effect, which is quite nice. So yeah, definitely the last sort of step in your routine once you've done you know, your foundation, just a nice way to set everything and sort of give everything a nice soft kind of focus effect. It's nice, I like it. Next up is the White Peach Multi-Dimensional Eyeshadow Palette infused with peach and sweet fig cream also. Ooh, yes, look at that. We've got three really, by the looks of it, pigmented, sparkly shimmer colors. And these ones here are more of your sort of soft matte, reminiscent of like the Sweet Peach palette, if I was gonna compare them to anything. But really the best way to tell what this is all gonna look like is by swatching it. I'm just gonna go in with this one because I think this is the one that everyone's probably gonna be most excited about. It's called Glistening Peach. So it's got a really beautiful peachy kind of gold shimmer through it, which is amazing. And then let's go for Peach Ice. This is giving me 90s vibes, which I'm enjoying a lot. So it's really icy. That'd be a really beautiful inner corner color as well, I'd probably say. Okay, Peach Passion. This is amazing. So it's got these purpley blue glitter flecks through it, which are amazing. It's definitely that disco smoky eye effect. That is incredible. And I don't normally wear like a really dark eye, but I would, I 100% would with that. And I'm running out of fingers. So let's go two more. Creme de la Peach, this looks really nice. Ooh, that has 
quite a nice amount of pigment to it. Really creamy. The thing with the Too Faced eyeshadows is they are so buttery. They, they just blend like an absolute dream. They're so easy to apply. They always look seamless. That's really nice. I really like that. That's sort of a summer vibe, if you will. Let's go on the grill. This is a really dark color as well. Really pigmented. Could probably wet a brush and use it as a bit of an eyeliner, I think, too, with that, given it's so dark. This is a winner. Good for every day, because you've got your lighter colors up there, and then when you just want to go all out disco, bang, bang, bang. Can't go wrong. All right, what else do I have in my bag of tricks? And here, ooh, Tatcha the Pearl. So this is an underlight and eye treatment. Heard a little bit about it. Let's I'm enjoying this packaging a lot. Ooh, okay. Consistency, kind of like chocolate mousse, not gonna lie. I'll try a little bit on the back of the hand. This one is gonna help, I believe, with some puffiness. Oh, it's also kind of, oh, it's like changing consistency on my hand. It's almost turning into water. Oh my God, look at this. It's like some kind of magic. So really, really hydrating. Like that's actually, if you can see that, that's turned really watery. So very lightweight consistency. I think this would be a good one for covering up any dark circles. And as you know, with Tatcha, they pack their products with incredible sort of botanical based ingredients that do a lot of amazing things. And I'm sure this one is no exception. I'm just really enjoying how sort of hydrated the skin feels. And of course, it would be remiss of me not to say that it looks like a Pokemon and you've got to catch them all. Okay, so what else do we have? Ooh. Ha ha. Nas. Lots of Nas. Excellent. What do we have here? So these are new shades in the Power Matte range. If you haven't tried the Power Matte range, you're missing out. They're amazing. They're super long wearing. They're lightweight, which I love in a lipstick. So this color here is Call Me. Oh man, look at that pigment payoff. That is a really nice pink there. Alrighty, and here we have Vane. This looks like a nice color as well. Oh yeah, look at that. I love a deep red. You cannot go wrong. The applicators on these are also really worth mentioning. They really allow for a precise application, like you can really get into the Cupid's bow because they're nice and pointy. I just cannot believe how much pigment these have. Like you could literally just do one layer and you would have a bold, rich lip color. They're amazing. Still with lip glosses. More Nars, more Nars. Yeah. The Full Vinyl Lip Lacquer. Okay, so as you can see, Many delicious colors here. It's very hard for me to actually pick which ones to swatch because they're all amazing. Let's swatch this one. This is so exciting. So this is called Abruzzo. Fun! Oh man, it's all kinds of disco glitter, changes color in different lights. This would be a good one, I feel, would probably make your lips appear a lot fuller because it's super reflective. Consistency, quite. Glossy, I guess, as you would imagine. This one here is Cape Town. Again, this looks like a lot of fun also. Oh, look at that gold! Serving some Beyonce vibes. Amazing, again, really pigmented. I mean, you can see the difference, in, obviously, in the finish. There is so much glitter packed into these two, especially. And one more for luck, I'm gonna pop it on my lips. This is Santo Domingo. Oh yeah. Good consistency, easy to apply, quite hydrating, not sticky. That's really nice. I like a good pinky nude and I'm enjoying that a lot. Last but not least, the NARS Danger Control Eyeshadow Palette. Ooh, fun. Look at this. We've got some really good looking colors in here. Lots of shimmers. I think I'm gonna go in with this one because it looks the most appealing. So this has got a pinky gold through it. Oh yeah, that is nice. Again, similar to the sort of P90 
peachy theme that we're seeing. This has gold sort of flex through it. And maybe we'll go for the purple. Good glitter, really gorgeous as well. And then this one kind of reminds me of the Albatross highlighter shade that NARS do. So again, could be a nice one for the inner corner of the eye. That is super shimmery and reflective. Oh yeah, that's, that's my favorite. So let's be honest, I could keep swatching all day, but I'm running out of room on my arm. All I need to say is everything here is amazing. You need to check it out, swatch it, play with it, apply it on your face. You're gonna have the best time. Thanks for joining me today and make sure you like and subscribe. Bye guys, see you next time.